determine an other property known as a percentage allocation due to factor. So, let me first of all tell you. You see, this is my steel bar over which I had already shown you. Okay, I have put a mark at the initial gauge length L0 is equal to 80 mm. Now let me show you that this is the bar of length L0. When this bar is being ruptured, At the time of the break, its shape would become like this. And here the length will increase and that length is given a name L U. These two end over here, one end is known as a cup and other end is known as a cone and the total length after fracture is represented length after fracture is represented by LU it's also known as a final gauge length Now, the piece which is broken by the machine during testing phase is with me. This portion is like a cup and cone. One is the depression and other one is on this side. Now, let me make the connection of these two pieces with each other. As the, these two pieces are connected with each other like this one. So here I will, I have marked over here. Here I will try to find out the value of uh, this uh, length over here. Now you see this length comes out to be equal to nearly 96. Let me fix it accurately. It is 96. It means that my initial length L0 is equal to 80. My final length LU is equal to 96. Here I have to find out percentage elongation. As per this formula, LU minus L naught over L naught into 100. And I will put the value in this formula 96 minus 80 over 80 into 100. Let me see what its uh, value comes out to be. 96 minus 80 change of length divided by total original length multiply by 100. So it comes out to be 20%. So, so this thing shows that before my material is broken down into two pieces, the change of the length has comes out to be 20%. So, so this is very important to know that the how much length change has occurred before fraction. So, so it is a 20%. Normally, if it is more than uh, 15 to 18%, it is being accepted because actually it is a low carbon steel, it is a TMT bar. So that is why this 20 percent increment is very much reliable and acceptable. Thank you for seeing this.